so he's, he immediately compensates. Right. Okay. Um, just like he has to go backwards because mm -hmm. he, is, he can't dorsal flex. Right. The pro basketball player? He's got an orthotic for every okay. game? A new one? Every game. Every game. Every every game. Wow. Anyone we know? Come on up. You would know him. Yeah. <laughs> and then, He's retired now. But okay. I don't know anybody that doesn't know him. <laughs> I, you know, thankfully, he at least took the shoes, autographed them, and, and gave them to charity. Like, people auctioned them off. Oh, really? And stuff, yeah. yeah. That would be nice. Yeah. Except, isn't there like a little break-in period there you would is. need That's for the shoes? There is. That's what I did. Although, if you make, get multiple pair of orthotics, and uh -huh. they're made off the same cast, then the break-in period is shorter. Your foot is already adapted. But the to shoes, the you know. Yeah, I know. Yeah. I don't know what his. He, he yeah. obviously needed. He needed that stability. Maybe you put him in the wash every time <laughs> to break him down a little. <laughs> so I think uh, now again the degree. I mean, he's just struggling because right. you know I think of of of, of the dorsiflexion. Sure. So what would be your start? Because I know the degrees of posting is going to be the same as. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. So I would start out here. I mean, this okay. is like two degrees, which is my tibial barum. Okay. It's just accommodating the tibial barum. But can you straighten your foot up a little bit? And then I just start like that forefoot. Uh huh. Uh, I mean, it was pretty. It was pretty decent. So. Yeah, there you go. I know they don't really fit you. Probably yeah. have some over here too. So I would. Yeah, that seven is probably like a five degree. Five. Okay. Okay. He looks swollen for some reason. <laughs> well, <laughs> you never paid attention to why. it before, right? <laughs> he could have it some edema. Heck right now. I don't know if you look at him from this angle. Look head on like this. It looks super bad. I just think, you know, the tissue is just yeah. working over. So doing this, you know, mm -hmm. and then I'm, I'm, I would have him stand on one limb again and see where we're at. I would, and I really pay attention here. How much you know, work is the foot doing just to stabilize itself? Well, I think with him leaning backwards, I think it could be fine. Color his head. Just do whatever you feel. <laughs> Go ahead. Um, stand on your uh, left foot. Left foot? Uh huh. No, yeah. right. Oh, the right foot. <laughs> your other left. Oh my god. What? Okay. Go ahead. So that. And then. Come back up. What do you feel? It's real tightness in my quads. Tightness in your quads. Do you feel anything in your ability? Ability to secure or not? No, I feel stable. You feel stable. Feet wise, I feel stable. I just you feel, feel tight. I don't feel like I can slide any further because my fist feels super tight. Okay. I mean, that's at, that's at about five degrees of four foot. I could take it down, you know, a couple of degrees and have them do it again, see if it's better or worse. And you're looking for... It's kind of, yeah, see, he'll even, like, now his, his toes are fully coming up. Okay, so, so that's he not needs enough. That. Yeah. So <laughs> that's need, not enough, yeah. yeah. So then i got to bring it back out there. Okay. So it's the... Uh... I mean, the least work, obviously, Once we set this left side, we should get better hip excursion out of this as well. Okay. You feel like you're starting to feel kind of tired? <laughs> I'm all right. Okay. <laughs> We're putting him through the ringer. Yeah. Yeah. No, That's why his feet are swollen. We're kind of like right. grabbing it, pulling it. Yeah. This is really diagnostic. Right, right. This, right. this guy's used to bagging heads. <laughs> a little assessment here. It's just like, well, he needs that Wii game where, you know, the balance game. Yeah. That's what yeah. you need, you know. The Wii balance. Yeah. It's part of the yoga, I think. You put that, like, center or however you do it. Yeah, closer. That's good. There you go. Bring 
can scoot it back outside. Yeah. So the base of it. Left to the left. Left out to the left. There. there we go. Was the right worse than the left? As from the stamp, are you, are you, um, when you did the eval? I thought he had more change uh, in from um, non-weight bearing to weight bearing on the right. Mm -hmm. I thought it was more. Um, oh, I mean, so. Okay, do the single limb on the left. But see, he doesn't lean back as much on the left. And we've already corrected. Okay, do it again. So I think uh, even just with that. Stability was there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's that rear foot. I mean, mm -hmm. I am trying to add it to simulate the sky, but it's not. It's making me feel like it's not doing what I want it to do. Well, okay, uh, now rotate at the hip. So would you uh, think that um, as we correct this, mm -hmm. maybe um, posting him exactly to this now would be too much. We should focus on scar tissue reduction, mobilization, whatnot, right. and then do another evaluation, or then do the um, orthotic based on the um, do you follow what I'm saying? Yeah, I still think that I d the foot structure is not, I mean, other than the mobility that you can get just through, you know, mm -hmm. you're manually manipulating and whatnot. Mm -hmm. um, his foot structure, it, it is what it is. It's not going to change. So we've got to just start. Yeah, I mean, he, he can blame his Dad or grandpa. You picked the wrong parents. <laughs> <laughs> hey, come on in. <laughs> you know, genetics are genetics. There's not, nothing that you can do about that. Yep. Better go ahead. We can do okay. it. Okay. Wait yeah, a little last time. Okay. Tell him what we're doing. He'll appreciate it. There's another <laughs> football player, that guy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, yeah. Let's, you know, come back up on the table here for me later. Okay. Stomach.